Welcome to Cognition Chunks. I'm going to Yellowstone National Park soon. This is my first visit and I would like to get as much out of my trip as I can. Can I use GPT to prepare? This is The Hike, Wraith Falls at Yellowstone National Park Overview Wraith Falls is a somewhat lesser known but equally enchanting waterfall located in the northern part of Yellowstone National Park. The falls cascade gracefully down a series of limestone steps, creating a wraith-like mist. This 100-foot horsetail waterfall is surrounded by lush greenery, and the hike is short enough to be family-friendly. Length and Duration The hike to Wraith Falls is quite short, about one mile round trip. The walk typically takes about 30 minutes to an hour, depending on how much time you spend at the waterfall itself. Trail Difficulty this is an easy hike with very minimal elevation gain, making it suitable for all ages and skill levels. The trail is well maintained and clearly marked. Highlights Wraith Falls, the main highlight is, of course, the stunning waterfall, particularly mesmerizing in the late spring and early summer. Wildlife Sightings the area is teeming with wildlife, especially birds and small mammals. Forest Walk Most of the trail takes you through a lush forest, providing an intimate nature experience. How to reach from the nearest hotel If you are staying at the Mammoth Hot Springs Hotel, one of the closest accommodations to the trailhead, follow these steps. 1. Exit the hotel Exit the Mammoth Hot Springs Hotel and find your way to Grand Loop Road. 2. Turn right. Once you reach Grand Loop Road, turn right, heading toward the northeast entrance. 3. Drive for 4.5 miles. Continue on Grand Loop Road for about 4.5 miles. Keep an eye out for signs leading to Wraith Falls. 4. Parking Area. You'll find a well-marked parking area designated for Wraith Falls hikers. 5. Trailhead. The trailhead is easily accessible from the parking lot. Begin your hike here. Tips. The falls are most vibrant in late spring and early summer when snowmelt swells the creek. Binoculars might enhance your wildlife spotting experience. Since the trail is relatively short, Water and light snacks should suffice. However, always carry a small first aid kit for safety. Conclusion The hike to Wraith Falls is perfect for those looking to explore a quieter part of Yellowstone National Park without venturing too far off the beaten path. It offers a short, serene trek to a beautiful waterfall that captures the essence of Yellowstone's natural beauty. This makes it an ideal choice for families, casual hikers, or anyone looking to escape the crowds and spend some time in nature. Welcome back, knowledge seekers and trailblazers. Today, we've reached the culminating moment of our expedition to Wraith Falls in the enigmatic landscape of Yellowstone National Park. As always, this hasn't been just a hike. It's been a multidimensional odyssey through a vast array of intellectual terrains. Let's unravel the complexities that make this natural marvel a treasure trove of insights. Spectroscopy and Light Interaction Wraith Falls is a breathtaking spectacle of flowing water, but have you ever paused to consider the interaction of light and water that enables us to perceive this beauty? It serves as an example of spectroscopic phenomena. The colors we see, or don't see, can inform us about the nature of light absorption and reflection, offering a tangible lesson in optics and quantum mechanics. The Power of Narrative and Folklore The very name, Wraith Falls, conjures images of the spectral and otherworldly. How does the infusion of such narrative elements affect our perception and experience? This beckons a deep dive into folklore studies, semiotics, and the psychology of storytelling. The falls become more than a natural feature, they are transformed into a narrative landscape ripe for interpretation. 
Hydrology and Water Conservation Waterfalls like Wraith Falls offer a real-world study in hydrology, the branch of science concerned with the movement, distribution, and quality of water. Understanding the waterfall's place in the broader hydrological cycle leads us to important questions about water conservation and sustainable management, particularly in the face of climate change. Metacognition and Mindfulness the soothing sounds and the meditative visuals of the falls provide an opportunity to explore metacognition. How does our awareness of our thoughts and feelings change in such environments? Do natural settings like this promote mindfulness? Our journey to Wraith Falls serves not only as a physical height, but also as a cognitive and emotional pilgrimage. The ethereal beauty of Wraith Falls presents an ideal opportunity to ponder on aesthetics and sensory perception. The intersection between art and science is more than a philosophical curiosity, it's a fundamental aspect of human cognition. Aeronautics and the Aerodynamics of Mist the mist created by the falls isn't just a refreshing byproduct of turbulent water. It serves as a real-world example of aerodynamic principles. The mist particles follow air currents that can be modeled and understood through the lens of aeronautical engineering. Who knew that a hike could offer insights into the dynamics of flight? Teleology and Philosophical Inquiry why do we find natural wonders like Wraith Falls so enthralling? This can lead to a teleological line of questioning about the purpose or end goals of human aesthetic preferences and natural beauty. Is there an evolutionary advantage to finding such places attractive, or does their appeal reside in some transcendental realm of the good? In conclusion, Wraith Falls serves as an expansive canvas painted with the intricate brushstrokes of physics, folklore, hydrology, cognitive science, engineering, and philosophy. As we wrap up this enlightening episode, remember that each step on a trail is also a step on an endless journey through the fertile fields of knowledge. This is Cognition Chunks, signing off until our next cognitive expedition. Stay curious and never stop exploring. Was this accurate? Did GPT just make up a bunch of stuff that does not exist or does not make sense? I'll let you know how GPT did in a few weeks.